before I, I tell you an original story, um, is just the way that I use these babushka doll dolls to, to briefly tell little bits and pieces about my family. And because there are, you've probably seen this kind of doll before, haven't you? I've got one, I've got a red one. So some of you might even have some. So the babushka dolls, they're a set. And because they're all female, these particular dolls, I'm going to tell you the story about the five of the women in my family through the generations. And this one represents for me my great-grandmother Emily Jane. And Emily Jane came here in 1884, a long, long time ago, you know, back in those olden days before we had electric light. And she came on a ship that took three months to come over here. And there was some tragedy on her way over. She lost her first child, her baby died while they were out at sea. It caught pneumonia and they had to bury it at sea, which was a very, very sad way to start her journey to Australia. But when she got here, then she, with her husband, they had many more children after that. But this is my grandmother. My grandmother was someone who, who made um, clothes for a living. She was a tailor. And um, she was a very strong-willed person. So as a child, if she didn't get her way, if Granny didn't do what she wanted, she would kick her. She would kick her in the leg. She's a very strong-willed woman. Um, and then she had my mum. My, this is my mum. And my mum was a very cuddly person who loved to tell me stories. Not folk tales so much as true stories. And she told me lots of stories in particular about Emily Jane. And she also told me stories about my younger brother and sister. And I might quickly tell you one of those stories. Um, so this is so this is great grandma, Emily Jane, my grandma Ada, my mum Muriel, and here's me, and that's around the same generation as my brother and sister. And then in here is my my daughter Layla, who also loves telling stories and singing and dancing. You know Layla too? Yeah. Oh. How do you spell your L A Y L A. There's different ways to spell it. You have that. Yeah. Okay. So what I just briefly mentioned that. In fact, I won't tell you any more about that because I want to move to the next story. But sometimes I tell the story about when my brother and sister nearly burnt the house down. That was one of my favourite stories as a kid. Um, there's all different stories about these, these characters, but you could use a babushka doll is one way, there's many ways of telling family stories, but if you have a set of babushka dolls, you could choose to use them to tell stories about your family. And you don't have to have a huge story about each character. You could just tell a little anecdote or a little bit of information. You could, and you could say to your mum and dad, hey, about, what about my great-grandma or what about my great-granddad? Do you know any stories about her? And as much detail as you can get, then you can paint in that picture until you might have a little bit of information about each one. So that's another way of telling a story. Okay? 